When we had last left Team Bald, yes, they were still continuing to sift through the great super city of Baldur's Gate. There was still quite a lot left to look through, but during their adventures did they uncover people missing gloves. Basilisks had run amok and were freezing people with their petrifying, steely gaze, and also they witnessed a siren, or a, a sirene, sirene, die from exposure. It was pretty wild. But now it was time to continue once more looking through, this time, the Harbor District. This is Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition. Welcome back. Let's do it. Let's see, let's unhide all this. Good. And where should we drop in next? How about the Harbor Master's building? You right? want it. Why not? You've got it. Let's do a quick save just as well, just in case. Good. Okay. Oh yeah, we should probably have Minsk check on all these things. I forget. I think we checked this one. I'm pretty sure we did, but just on the off chance that we had not. Sorry, move my mic a little bit. I need to get one of those, like, super good mic arms or whatever that you can't even hear when you touch. There's, like, a standard one that almost everybody seems to use. There's probably other ones that are really good as well, but they might either be, like, too expensive or... I don't know. Difficult to find out which ones they are. Okay. Here we go. I've got this. Head on inside here. Man, what a eerie look for the harbor thing. Oh, is this is this like water down here, I guess? Okay. You want it? You've got it. Quick save. Hello. Nasty times are coming, I reckon. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey there. What can I do for ya? We've been investigating some of the weird goings on of Baldur's Gate, and we thought that the harbor master must know a great deal. What's with the comings and goings of the merchant ships? Oh, we wanted to charter a ship. We're sorry to have bothered you. Yeah, we, there is something off about the merchants, right? We haven't yet dug into a lot of it, but... Eh. What's with the comings and goings of the merchant ships? Yeah, as the harbor master, I'm privy to a lot of what's going on. What's it that you want to know? Tell us what you know about the iron shortage. The iron shortage, eh? Well, there's not much to tell. With the Nashkel mines basically shut down and bandits making it impossible to ship overland, irons become rare. Recently, though, the Iron Throne's been shipping in iron through their merchant fleet. It's really strange, because their main competitors aren't doing the same. They're just letting the uh, the throne hog the whole market. Hmm. Oh, look at this. According to the Harbor Master, the Iron Throne has been shipping iron into the city via its merchant fleet. That makes sense. I guess, you know, it's nice for them to have seized control of that mine, but uh, that was probably just gravy on top of their pre-existing plan. Don't worry about okay. me. Okay. I'm really busy now, so I'm gonna have to ask you to come back sometime later. Oh. Shit, I would have liked to have heard all of your bits of dialogue, but <laughs> fair enough. Yeah, fairly small for a gigantic building on the exterior. Okay. Maybe most of it is, like, on a different floor. There we are. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> okay. Don't worry about me. Let's go on over here. Now, what is this? Yeah, this is just an unknown building. Let's do a quick save in case there's, like, some weird fucked up thing. I want to say that the Ogre Magi that we fought and randomly ran into, it might be in this one or this building. We definitely don't want to go into the Iron Throne building just yet. I've got this. Okay. That's locked. Okay, let's give it a quick pick. I'm gone. There we are. You want it? And you got it. in we are. Oh, Cordier. Hello. You want it? Glad to it. meet you, friend. Pleasure to meet you. The name's Cordier. Okay. What do you? 
<laughs> That's it? Okay. Pl pleasure to meet you too. Would they have said something else if we weren't in the Thieves Guild, I guess? How odd. I'm gone. Or are they not a thief? Do you actually live in this building? Is this your house? Let's check your stuff. Just a club. One gold piece. Check upstairs here. I've done Anyone had up here? This. Bunch of things to look through. Eh, nothing in that. Nothing in that. Anyone over on this end? Anyone sleeping? Ooh, a couple people sleeping together. Okay. Nothing in their containers, though. Ah, a book. History of Shadowdale, Volume 1. Pretty sure we've got that. Almost positive, yeah. Okay. There we are. I'm gone. Over here. Huh, healing potion. I'll take it. Okay. Let's head on down. Very well. How odd. Maybe we have to come back to this person at a later date for Don't a different quest? Me. Cordier? Oh, shit. There we go. I've got this. Okay. Oh, what? Oh, this is the sewer! This is one of the sewer access points. Holy shit, this is how we get down there. Wow, I would have never even noticed. We can go in through these? I'm assuming we must lift up the grate. Right? Okay, let's do a quick save. Let's look for a body down here, I guess. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Yo, why do the sewers sound so fucked up? Oh, no. Ooh, there's some big eggs. Okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> rat child <laughs> I am rat child I destroy all those who oppose my people feel the wrath of rat child feel my wrath and tremble feel your wrath by all the gods you're just a kobold I think you might have a small mix up on who should be trembling draw steel my friends and let's cut up this little these little dog men who exactly are your people Please don't hurt us, oh mighty rat child. Who are your people? My people are rulers of the deeps, where your people's wastes are set. That's where, that where we thrive. Rat child's tribe is stronger than all others. Rat child's tribe trained to beat anyone. Anyone. No one can stand up to rat child and tribe. That's wonderful that you live down here where all of our waste is dumped. You should be real proud. I'm pretty sure we can beat you, Rat Child. Let's say that. You underestimate Rat Child. Many have done so. Even Harpers have done so. All have felt Rat Child's wrath. <gasps> oh my gosh. Come on, Commandos. Okay. Let's get him. Oh my gosh. Some of us really might die here. <laughs> okay. Let's see, let's do some of that. The issue is, of course, that I can't come down here alone. Right? Let's see, dinner here, throw down... ...some horror over here. Oh, shit. Jeez. Okay, get a heal on you. If you can, she's probably dead. Yep, fucking dead. If we could only send in only our, our melee exclusively. Hmm. Yeah. That's a tough one. Okay, let's quick load here. Should we try it again? Cities are always I think so let's try it again. Okay. So many people. There we are. I want to say, please don't hurt us, oh mighty rat child. You mock rat child. No one mocks rat child and lives. Yip, yip, yip. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought we were being sincere. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. So let's head on back here and take care of business this way. 
We'll try and pop off a haste as well. Good. And also, how about... Bless. We'll bless everyone. Good. Okay. We'll see how this goes. Alright. Let's go over here. Khalid, you go over here. Great. Okay. Actually, I'm going to heal up dinner here. Because she's going to take some heavy artillery fire. Oh shit, as is Imola. Holy hell. Okay. Let's apply the healing. Oh, I can't control myself. What happened? What happened to me? Oh jeez, what is this debuff? Rigid sinking. Oh fuck, I'm like dumb as hell then? Okay. I should have activated my Enrage. I didn't know they were capable of this. This sort of foul magic. Okay. Let's activate that. Hopefully Imwin can hang on there. I guess we can send Imwin further down this way. Withdraw a bit. Okay. Let's also have her drink a potion. Why not? Okay. Good. Let's send in... We got the horror popping. Let's get another one. Because it didn't roll successfully against everyone. Okay. Am I still unable to control myself? I think so. Okay. That's fine. Let's see. What else have we got? We could summon insects. That could be useful. There we are. Okay, we're getting them. Lovely. Yeah, that was a good move. Sending people down the hallway. Okay. This way. Whew. Very good. Very nice. Eat shit, rat child. Okay. Let's grab all of your rat child amazing items and stuff. Look, I still can't even control myself. How long does this last for? Do I need to, like, cast a dispel? Let's see. Let's... Well... Let's just see what the fuck happens. Ooh! It looked like it reflected back onto dinner here. Oh, shit, there I go. No less than done. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna wander through I've the entire dungeon pulling everything, I guess. That's fine. Okay. Can we throw some more heals onto Imwin? Uh-oh. What's that? Combat? Don't worry about me. Oh, it was just whenever our shit wore off. It activated. Okay, let's get Evil these arrows and stuff. Careful not to step in any. Anything else? No, I think we're I'm good. Gone. Oh, nope, there's more. A lot of these decent looking arrows. Okay, let's throw them onto you. Can we get an auto ID? Hey, arrow fire plus two. Nice. Okay. Good. You know, I'm thinking maybe we finally start using some of these special arrows, at least the plus ones, right? Fuck it. Okay, a quick save. And should we look around here? How big is this area? Right, we're just supposed to find a body. I've got Fuck this. it. Let's go up and over here. Do a quick save. Oh, do you think we should rest? Here, let's go up this area. And let's see, can we rest down here without drawing the ire of more of the rat child's army? Here, let's ID this one. Send that over to Imowen. Good. Let's see. Oh, I may not rest Don't at this worry time. About me. Why? Huh. Oh, there we go. Weird. I wonder why that was. Maybe because we were standing on something weird? I don't I've know. got this. Okay. Damn, Ratchild was just chilling down here. Fuck, should we be careful about traps? I don't know. Maybe? Let's be a little careful, just in case. Ugh. Damn, people poop all this stuff out? Oh, here's a body. How come we can't take this one for our necromancer friend? <laughs> Alright, fine. It's going up here. Dude, this area is big. Look at this. Oh shit, I can talk to rats? Hello, rats. What the 
fuck? They're like eating on some sort of carcass. You want it? Nasty. You've got it. Oh, does this actually lead topside? Oh yeah, wow. Okay. Don't worry Dude, about I would have never even noticed this. It was by pure chance that I found it. Don't worry about <laughs> me. Okay. Let's go over here. Why not? Let's keep quick saving in case there is like booby traps in the sewers. Camaraderie. Fucking and sewer level, huh? And steel on steel. Okay. The stuff of legend. It's over here. Right, boo. So far there haven't been any other dudes ready to accost us down here. Let's just link these two up via the fog of war. Okay. Good. You know what? I was planning on going clockwise through this, but I guess we're going counterclockwise. Why not? Quick save again. What are these, like... Like floodgates or something? I think so. Okay. Oh, we can activate this valve. To what end? Let's do it. Oh! Oh, I'm in a different area now. You want okay, it? let's You've activate it. it again. Fuck. Okay, we weren't activating a valve. We were. I've oh, this is like an end of the tile. Huh. Weird. I've okay. Got this. Jeez. Normally you can't go through shit like that, right? Hmm. Like we've been in dungeons before where there's been the hint of something else further in. Like, I'm pretty sure one of the mines, there was something like that and we couldn't go through it. Oh shit, mustard jelly. Get it, Minsk. Minsk, you can solo that. We quick saved. There you go. Good stuff. Okay. Oh, and look, here's another one. Wow. I've got this. You must gather your party before. Holy shit! Forth. This sh this shit really like spreads out and all that. Sewer cleaner. Yo, you were down here with the rat child. Oh my gosh! How did you survive? Are you? F oh shit! There's a bunch of you here. Hello, Hello pal. Mm, shouldn't shouldn't be down here. Not safe if you don't know you where you're at. A bound probably can't stand the smell by the. Are their noses like stuffed up with a whole bunch of shit so they don't smell stinky stuff? Okay, look more more areas where it like splits off. Dude, this is weird. Huh? And then here it links back into the center area. Okay. Fuck, we're never gonna find this body at this rate. Jeez. In knowing that it's so big, part of me wants to just, you know, wrap up this tile and then go back topside and continue exploring around there. Because, frankly, what if... What if the, the, like, size of the sewers turns out to be comparable to the size of the actual fucking city? <laughs> okay. Like, maybe not one-to-one, -one, because there's probably some areas that have, like, shared sewers and all that, as we saw. One of these put us up in the the area where the main gate is, the front gate. But it looks like it's- oh, shit. Male body, male body. How much does it weigh? 185? How much can I carry? I can carry a male body. You want it? You got it. I'll carry a couple of them. Let's see. Let's move the Ankheg. Her. And Wyvern Head. Shit, maybe I can't carry two. <laughs> two male bodies. <laughs> maybe I can't do that. Okay. Hmm. Fuck. Everybody else is a baby. Do I need two bodies? Maybe I only want one. Oh shit, that encumbers me just as well. Okay. There you go. Fine. That'll do. You want okay. it? You got it. Let's keep looking around. I guess we have our shit now. Hopefully the necromancer doesn't need two bodies. I'm still kind of unsure about helping this necromancer, right? <laughs> like it seems pretty evil. <laughs> we'll see where it goes though. Worst case if if it does end up going like we we got baited into doing a 
a very out of character act. We'll quick load. <laughs> okay. Cause we are we are neutral good. Yeah, we're neutral good. Hmm. Going down here. Yeah, these these sewers really like wind and twist, like holy hell. Looks like they were built by a novice player of Sim City, or I guess City Skylines in this era. <laughs> right, just throwing pipes all over the place to get your city hooked up. Okay. Over here. Oh, look, the sewer cleaner has moved over. Yeah, better clean up all these, like, dangerous weapons out of the sewers. <laughs> They'll clog a pipe. Frankly, I'm surprised we haven't seen more jellies, like more slimes down here. This seems like a location ripe for slimage. Okay. Over here. Good. Wow, this one also... There are so many branches. Oh my god. Well, at least we, now we know, right? I, I had no idea this was here in the first place. <laughs> I thought we would find, like, a manhole cover. But it was actually one of these grates that have probably been all over each and every tile of the city. You know? Like, holy fuck. Oh, I can't access the next area from this one. Weird, why is that? You would think... Huh. This one works. This one works. This one doesn't work. This one works. This one also- why does that one not work? Huh. Weird, I wonder what the distinction is. Oh well. I think we came up from- or came down from this set of, uh, rungs. Let's do you it again. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Okay. You must gather your party before venturing there forth. There we go. I've got cool. this. Cool. Cool, but weird. There we are. Let's do a quick pick. See what's in here. What is this? Isn't this a... Yopalin's Tavern. I have no idea how to say this name, but I've seen it in multiple places. Oh. oh shit. Bunch of sailors in here. That makes sense. Are you coming over to speak with me? Sailor Joss. You want it? Uh, you got it. Uh, I think I had too much to drink. Okay, we know this. What do you do with the drink? What do you do with the drink? What do you do with the drink? Oh, I don't know this one. I flounder and then I lobster. I flounder and then I lobster. But with all my soul, I know she'll be a swimming home to me. I don't know that one. Sailor Dan? Is there something, like, unique about their names? Is, there, is this, like, a reference to something? All right there, mate. Mate, pull you up a chair and let us carouse together. We all here be sailors of the Yawning Mary, testing our land livers while on shore leave. The Yawning Mary? Aye, oh, she's a fine ship who moves at a fast clip. There's never been better. You have my word. We'd have outsailed Valderon himself if he was still here to meet the challenge. Okay. Can I talk to you again about the other thing? From where do you hail? What's that? I, I be a salt and crusted citizen of the high seas. I be an a ten time survivor of the scurvy wasting. Never winter water deep at the gate. I've cut la. I lay. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> Sorry, that, he got me that time. He won. Oh. I'll lay anchor in them all, but I'll never rest easy with their shiftless firmaments beneath me. Okay. How about Noof? Ooh! Ooh. Why are the streets so wobbly? I said a boy that builds the boat. I said a boy that sails her. I said a boy that catches the fish and brings them home to Lisa. Over Don't here. worry about me. I think we spoke with Finch. Did we speak with Ned, though? We spoke with Joss, but I don't think we spoke with Ned. There you are. 
I need some ale. Raise a jolly good fellow, raise a jolly good fellow, raise a jolly good fellow. Nobody can deny, nobody can deny, nobody can deny. Oh. Sing the song again. Come on, we loved it so much. We love to hear it. We, we have to hear it again. Raise a jolly good fellow, raise a jolly good fellow. Sing it again. Will something happen if I keep doing this? Sing it again! Sing it again! Sing it again! Keep going! Yes! Yes! <laughs> he keeps going faster and faster. <laughs> okay, we don't need to hear the song no more. That's it? <laughs> that's the interaction? I got this. Okay. Maybe that's a sign that we need to, like, pickpocket him. Let's do a quick save. Alas, we, we have no skilled pickpocket among us. Pray tell what has brought you into my fine establishment today. New customers are always a welcome sight. I have a coin or two burning a hole in my purse. Let's see what you have to offer. Sorry, but I have no interest in your services at the moment. Perhaps another- yeah, let's see what you got. Beds. Drinks. I wonder if there's anything different based on the, like, tile of Baldur's Gate that we're in. It seems like it's not the case. I've got this. Like it's just regardless of the inn. Oh fuck, there's even more sailors back here. Al? Did we talk to Al? Oh, it's Yeslik! <laughs> I might been here for a second. What you call fish with no eyes? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Yes, like, where do I remember you from? I don't even recall. Oh. Right, you're the dude from inside of the... The uh, Iron Thrones controlled mine, right? It was your ancestors who originally dug up the mine or whatever. Established it. Okay. Wow, so you're out here. We can't even get you to join us. Don't worry about me. Okay. Huh. Is he a sailor? I don't think so. Maybe he just decided to go to the harbor. Maybe he likes the atmosphere. You want Okay, it? You let's keep it. rolling around here, see what's up. Hmm. Anything over this way, over yonder? Oh, shit. Look, wow, this kind of goes, whoa, this goes back, whoa, this is here? What is this secret area? Oh, shit. Oh my god, if there's actually a building back here that we can enter, that would be fucking amazing. The door to this house is rotting off its hinges. You assume the house has been abandoned for years. Okay. Well, hell, let's check these for our gauntlets that we're looking for. No gauntlets. Okay. Don't worry about me. Anything else around here? Nope, that's it. There's just like a weird little section of city. <laughs> it's like hard to find. I guess if you fast travel from from like up here, you would hit it. Well, no, because you would hit the main gate in the center of town, right? Huh. How odd. There we go. Let's head over here. Yeah, we still need our gauntlets. Okay. Wizard needs gauntlet badly. Oh, sorry, that's bad. <laughs> that's rough. That's a rough one. <laughs> still need to workshop that one. <laughs> okay. Let's go over here. Well, we don't want. We definitely don't want to go in there. Okay, that's the that's the cursed one. And this one is probably. I think this is the one that contains the Ogre Magi from before. Let's send Minsk down here to check all these barrels and stuff for our gauntlets. Now, are these two separate barrels? I think. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Man, maybe these barrels are just nowhere to fucking be seen. Don't Holy worry about shit. Me. Okay. Over here. And then, let's Gold check this out. Unpacking steel. steel! Still my favorite. <laughs> Down this. This little pier. Oh, look at this. Do they have something to say? I want hey. my mommy. I'm gonna use magic when I get older. It's beautiful. You wanna fight me? Oh, come on. You wanna fight? You don't look friendly at all. 
Pretty sure I heard that kid in like an early episode of The Simpsons. Don't worry about okay. me. Okay. Let's check this, just double check. I'm pretty sure this is the Ogre Magi one. I'm gone. Yeah, it is. Okay. Let's do our quick load. Oh, whoops. Can't do it while we're in combat. There we go. You want Yeah, because they seem part. relevant to the main plot, especially given their distance from the Iron Thrones headquarters. Oh, this is also locked. Very well, let's do a quick save, give it a quick pick. I am gone. What lurks within? Let's get everyone in you here, want it? just in case You've it's it. some sort of weird encounter. You want it? You got it. Oh, shit. There we go. You want okay. it? Okay. Is got there it. anyone important here that's like named or whatever? I'm no. gone. We can't steal on this floor because there's too many people running around. How about over here? Any of these need picking? Nah. These little drawers usually, like the end tables, usually not much of value in them, right? Just like a few gold pieces here and there. But these, sometimes they hold books that we want. Can't pick any of these. What have we got inside? A short sword and nothing. What the heck? All right, let's get out of I here. It's gonna say we could check that shelf over there, Don't but worry about me. couldn't enter stealth. Do we need to pick this door too? Nope, we do not. Don't worry about me. Oh, yeah, we do. It didn't show up green. I guess because it's purple this already. Way. I think they have to be blue, right, to show up as green. You want it? You got it. Good. Okay. Let's I head on this. upstairs. Check their shit. Actually. Yeah, let's just send I've him away so we don't get, like, overcrowded. I've done dun, had enough dun, of this. Da, da, da. Anything here? One gold. Okay. This thing need picking? No, it did not. Some random wooden blunt weapons, though. Okay. I've got let's head this. on out of here. Man, did we check everything here now except for... Stuff down in this section? I think so. Don't worry yeah. about me. Perhaps this group needs not quite as much help as I thought. I forget, didn't we have another reason to come back to this temple? Let me check here. Who was it for? Goxir the Seer? Bring him a Sphine gem. I think we found one, didn't we? Didn't we find a Sphine gem? I don't know where we found it, but I think we did find one. Let's see. Yeah, go rock the diseased. The ladies' hall. Is this the ladies' hall? I forget which which religious group is this. Okay. Water Queen's house. But is that one also colloquially referred to as the ladies' hall? I don't think so. I think it might be something else. Larceny at the Hall of Wonders. That couldn't be it. Gauntlets. No. Hmm. Seven Sons. Captive Nymph. Nah, nothing. Okay. Maybe we should go turn in this body because it is so heavy. Don't right. worry about me. I mean, I guess we could go in here and look around because we never actually did fully look around inside. Do I need to pick this? this way. Got quick save done, so... Should be good. Oh shit, these are the gauntlets! Hey! Let's ID them. Zarnus's second sword arm. I think we saw one of these or have one. Right? Hmm. Thacko plus one. I'm pretty sure we've got them on someone right now. Because the Thacko is really nice. Don't worry about okay. me. Okay. Over here. Anything of interest? Should we look down this section? It's like a little narrow area of the pier or of the harbor. Nah, nothing there. Yeah, let's go inside here and fully look around. Priestess of you Umberley, what do you, you say? The witch queen brooks no insolence. Tread carefully within the house of the bitch goddess. Conduct your business and go, lest she find a way to drown you even in the driest desert. Okay. I've got this. But are you fine with me, like, roaming around? It seems that way. 
I guess there's actually nothing here of interest for us. We killed everything interesting in here. Is there another route that we could take? No. Okay. Well, let's get out of here. There we go. Easy you enough. It, you got it. Okay. I guess since we're in the area, let's keep looking down this narrow stretch. We'll just clear this off. That way we know once we go back to Elf Song, we'll know in the back of our mind that like, yeah, we've cleared out everything except for the seemingly main quest related to buildings. Okay, now where was Elf Song at? Fuck me. I think it was in the last one that we explored. We'll do a quick check. Good on you if you save the day. Okay, so there we go. Right here. Elf Song. There's Blade and Stars. Yeah, no Elf Song. Didn't we have something that we needed at the Blade and Stars? Hmm. Yeah, for Goxir the Seer. Do we have this Sphine gem? Hang on, let's check. I think we do. Oh shit, it's not alphabetized. Okay. Sphine- Oh, there we go! To backpack. Oh, we've got a few of them. Okay. Sure. Let's turn this in then. You want it? You've got it. Goxir the Seer. Here's your Sphine gem. Don't worry about me. I forgot how this person sounded. The Sphine Gem. Indeed, then. You are more than you appear. Someday you must journey further through the muck and mire of this place, for it will tell you as much or more than all of fabled Candle Keep. Like yourself, this city is more than it appears. There are cities below cities, dreams beneath dreams. The past laying buried beneath the crushing weight of the present. Go now, wander, for the time will come when you must walk through the darkness to find the light. Wow, okay. <laughs> I feel like you just told me what's, what to expect. Okay, so this is a city built on top of a city and there's going to be something underneath. That must be why the sewers are so fucking big. <laughs> And they're told, yeah, go through the darkness to find the light. Yeah, through the darkness of the sewers, and there'll be, like, another area that's more well-lit or something, right? Like, another dungeon. Or maybe even an entirely active city under it, right? I would assume it's, like, a derelict city, though, right? An abandoned old one or whatever. Interesting. Okay, cool. I gave Gaxir the Seer the Sphine Gem he wanted, and... All he said was that my future lies beyond the muck and mire of Baldur's Gate. Okay, come on, me. Come on, Lila Schnub. Let's get it together. He also said... City... Yeah, there are cities below cities. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know, that makes something. Dreams beneath dreams. I'm not sure. In some way, that's vaguely tied to our dreams. The past laying buried beneath the crushing way of the present... Like, like I said... There, there's got to be something very important underneath the city. Uh, let's see. Go now, wander through the darkness to find the light. Yeah, the sewers. Okay. <laughs> I feel like this is alluding to shit that is yet to come. Very well. Okay. You want it? You got it. Let's see over here. I've got this. I will be shocked if that, <laughs> that turns out to not be the case. But in the same vein, it's kind of shocking that <laughs> that they just kind of like openly spill the beans like that's not like <laughs> I guess I'm accustomed to recently we've been playing um, Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines as well in tandem with this and they they have like some secret stuff in there as well but they try I've got this significantly harder to hide their their twists and all that but it seems like this one this I don't know may, maybe for the time they, they were just like yeah no one will get this no one will fucking see this shit coming <laughs> <laughs> right? I guess, I don't know, was like a city built on top of another city a common trope in various media already at the time? I'd assume so. Why wouldn't it be? Right? Why, like, I guess my question, my, my response to that is, why wouldn't it be? I've got this. Okay. So what is this? Are we, is this Elf Song? Fuck, who are we supposed to look for an elf song again? I fucking forgot because... Perhaps this group needs not quite as much help Archeon. as I thought. Okay. I got so carried away thinking about... 
<laughs> about cities beneath cities. Don't worry about okay. me. Let's see. Where is this person? Were they in one of the side rooms or whatever? Here, let's send Minsk around to scout. Butt kicking for goodness. Let's see. They in here? Nope. Isn't this the one with the rogues or ruffians even? Merchant. Huh. Oh wait. A Lindara. No. That ain't it. Yeah, what the heck? Okay. Don't worry let's about head down. me. Don't worry about me. Where is this necromantic dude? Butt kicking for goodness. Am I thinking of the wrong person? A necromancer na Oh, his house is just south of I'm fucking dumb. I didn't read the entire thing. Don't worry about me. <laughs> okay. Let's see. So I've it must be this. is it labeled? Well, this one's labeled, so it must be this house. Okay. Let's do a quick save before we get in too deep here. Just in case we don't want to actually go through with this plan. <laughs> right? I don't know if I want to help the necromancer, okay? <laughs> I don't I don't know if I want to do that. Okay. Over here. Good. Hello, this. Archeon. Ah, a ripe one. You've done well there, haven't ya? Here's 250 gold pieces to relieve the stink of it all. Ah, Nympha, I'll have that ring yet. Huh? Archeon the Necromancer has his corpse and I have some more gold. Okay. Well, we didn't get, like, negative rep. Don't worry about me. Long live the stench of the dead, cousin. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, let's get out of here. Sure, just, you know, just another you want it, you've got it. <laughs> quest like any other. <laughs> what a freak. Let's see. Let's bring up our map here. Um, let's see. Oh. Archeon and Nemfri. Oh, shit. Ordulinian has told me the tale of two of Baldur's Gate's greatest fools, necromancers and ex-lovers, Nemfri and Archeon. He appears to have grown tired of their endless feuding, and has asked me to bring Archeon's bloodstone amulet and Nemfri's onyx ring to him so that their dispute might be settled once and for all. I can find Ordulinian at the Sorceress Sundries. Wait, so how the hell do I get the bloodstone amulet? Do I already have it? Did I already search through his shit? Oh shit, bloodstone amulet. Or will it be named like Archeon's bloodstone amulet? I think this counts. Just like quickly trying to scan through for the word Archeon. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. And what was the other item that we needed? Onyx ring. Okay. I wonder if we need a specific version. I don't... I'm feeling like the answer is no. Onyx ring. Here we go! Oh, shit! Okay. Now, where is this person? Adventure and steel at Sorcerer's Sundries. Yeah, that's the shop in the first it. section of town, isn't it? In fact, yeah, we're here. This is it, isn't it? Right here? Yeah, Sorcerer's Sundries. Fuck I've yeah, let's this. check it out. Good on you if you save the day. Let's see, let's pull these things out of Imwin's inventory here. Hopefully this this counts, right? Okay, good. Wow. Got a question and I didn't even realize it. Don't worry about me. Okay. Wait for the rest of the team to catch up. Do a quick save just as well. Head on in. Good. Don't worry about me. Okay, dude. I got these things. You want them? So, how fair are dear Nemfri and Archeon? What? This way. Maybe it doesn't count then. Oh, shit. Okay, well, what the fuck can you do? <laughs> Don't worry Let's about go back. Me. Yeah, m we must need, like, a named version of their stuff. Don't worry about me. Hmm. Okay. Who wanted the gauntlets again? Where was the gauntlet person? Noralee's gauntlets. Fuck. Where does Noralee live? Fuck me. Let's do a quick save. We'll just send Imowen in because we're going to do some had theft. Of this. We may even need to steal shit from I've right there. Done had enough of this. We'll see. 
Anything up top that we haven't gone through? I think we've been through all this. The only thing that we probably still need to hit is Archean's chest back there. I've done had enough of this. Okay. Let's do a quick save. Fuck. Can you just Oh, you don't even have it. Huh. Thieving? Target has no items that can be stolen by a cut purse of your skill. Oh, shit. Is it on your person, then? Should I, like, pop some kind of bonus pickpocket potion? I know we've got some. We even got some recently. Let's see, what would it be? Like, thieving? Is there a potion of thieving or stealing shit? Master thievery. Okay. Let's try it. There we are. And then we already quick save just in case this doesn't go well. Good. Did we get it? Oh, fuck yes! Okay. Awesome. Huh. Okay, cool. <laughs> Let's quick save again. You don't seem to mind me taking these either. I don't know why, but thanks. <laughs> okay, let's pass this off to dinner here. Have an ID on those. Oh shit, we're out of spells. Okay, that's fine. We'll hit up I've another end. For now, however, if you'd like to stick around, I think we'll end the video, but we will do a little bit of reading, right? We'll save uh, some extra time for us to read some shit. How about we read this? History of the Dead Three. Ooh. Let's cross this out. If you'll excuse me, I'm going to take a quick drink as well this time. Okay. History of the Dead Three. Oh, shit. History of the Dead Three. Knuckle Bones, Skull Bowling, and the Empty Throne. In ages past... There was but one god of strife, death, and the dead, and he was known as Yurgle, lord of the end of everything. Yurgle fomented and fed on the discord among mortals and powers alike. When beings slew each other in their quest for power or in their hatred, he welcomed them into his shadowy kingdom of eternal gloom. As all things died, everything came to him eventually. And over time, he built his power into a kingdom unchallenged by any other god. Eventually, however, he grew tired of his duties, for he knew them too well. Without challenge, there's nothing, and in nothingness, there is only gloom. In such a state, the difference between absolute power and absolute powerlessness is undetectable. During this dark era, there arose three powerful mortals, Bane, <gasps> Baal, and Mirkel, who lusted after the power Yurgle wielded. The trio forged an unholy pact, agreeing that they would dare to seek that they would dare to seek such ultimate power or die in the attempt. Over, this, over the length and breadth of the realms they strode, seeking powerful magic and spells and defying death at every turn. No matter what monster they confronted or what spells they braved, the three mortals emerged, unscathed at every turn. Eventually, the trio destroyed one of the seven lost gods, and they each seized a portion of of his divine essence for themselves. The trio then journeyed into the Grey Waste and sought out the Castle of Bone. Through armies of skeletons, legions of zombies, hordes of non-corporeal undead, and a gauntlet of liches they battled. Eventually, they reached the object of their lifelong quest, the Bone Throne. <laughs> The bone throne, come on. 
I claim this throne of evil, shouted Bane the tyrant. I'll destroy you before you can raise a finger, threatened Ball the assassin. And I shall imprison your essence for eternity, promised Mirkel the necromancer. Yurgle arose from his throne with a weary expression and said, The throne is yours. I have grown weary of this empty power. Take it, if you wish. I promise to serve and guide you as your seneschal until you grow comfortable with the position. Before the trio, before the stunned trio could react, the Lord of the Dead continued, Who among you shall rule? The trio immediately fell into fighting amongst themselves while Yurgle looked on with indifference. When eventually it appeared that either they would all die of exhaustion or battle on for an eternity, the Lord of the End of Everything intervened. After all you have sacrificed, would you come away with nothing? Why don't you divide the portfolios of the office and engage in a game of skill for them? asked Yurgle. Bane, Ball, and Mirkel considered the god's offer, and agreed. Yurgle took the heads of his three most powerful liches, and gave them to the trio that they would compete by bowling the skulls. What the fuck? <laughs> That's, okay, this stuff at the beginning. The title, or subtitle even. Each mortal rolled a skull across the gray waste, having agreed that the winner would be he who bowled the farthest. <laughs> bowled? <laughs> so fucking goofy. Is this like a children's tale? Like a children's tale interpreting something that really happened or like some kind of folklore? <laughs> Malar, the Beast Lord, arrived to visit Yurgle at this moment. After quickly ascertaining that the winner of the contest would get all of Yurgle's power, he chased off after the three skulls to make sure the contest would be halted until he had a chance to participate for, the, for part of the prize. Bane, Ball, and Miracle again fell to fighting, as it was obvious their sport was ruined. And again, Yurgle intervened. Why don't you allow Lady Luck to decide so you don't have to share with the beast. The trio agreed, and Yurgle broke off his skeletal finger bones and gave them to the players. When Malar returned from chasing the skulls, he found that the trio had just finished a game of knuckle bones. Bane cried out triumphantly, As winner I choose to rule for all eternity as the ultimate tyrant. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can induce hatred and strife at my whim, and all will bow down before me while in my kingdom. Miracle, who had won second place, declared, But I choose the dead, and by doing so I truly win, because all you are lord over, Bane, will eventually be mine. All things must die, even gods. Ball who finished third, demurred. I choose death. It is by my hand that all that you rule, Lord Bane, will eventually pass to Lord Miracle. Both of you must pay honor to me and obey my wishes, since I can destroy your kingdom, Bane, by murdering your subjects, and I can starve your kingdom, Miracle, by staying my hand. Malar growled in frustration, but could do nothing. And yet... Only the beasts were left for him, and Yurgle merely smiled, for he had been delivered. Huh. What an interesting tale. Also very fascinating that there are three of these dudes. When, as far as I know, like, I've heard of Merkel before, right? I don't remember where, but we have heard of Merkel before in passing somewhere. Maybe it was like that evil shrine inside of the, the mines that the Iron Throne took over. Maybe that was the shrine? Merkel? Merkel shrine? Hmm. But alas, like, they're so intertwined in this story, I wonder if the other two will come up as well, because I think it's all but given that Ball will be our primary antagonist, given, like, you know, what we said at the beginning with the, the difficulty and all that. 
Hmm. Weird. Yeah. I feel like we have an idea of who the players are, but we just don't know the play. Hmm? Okay. Well, when next we come back, we'll perhaps steal another one of these fantastic items, but we will most assuredly turn in some gauntlets. Until next time, please take care of each other. Bye.